Hello, and welcome to Conservation Skills in 10 Minutes or Less. This series of short, skill-based videos is brought to you by the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service's National Conservation Training Center in Shepherdstown, West Virginia. If you have a few minutes, pull up a chair and pick up a new conservation skill or refresh an old one on topics ranging from fish culture to bird identification to stream restoration. Enjoy. A great tip to make your writing easier to comprehend is to keep the subjects and verbs in your sentences close together. Some writers tend to insert a lot of text that describes the subject between the subject and the verb. Let's look at this example. Bald eagles, because their large eyes leave no space in the skull for muscles that would allow them to roll their eyes, turn their heads. If the subject is so far away from the verb, by the time readers reach it, they've forgotten what the subject was. And then they have to read the sentence again to understand its meaning. We've all had that happen to us, and it's frustrating. It's easy to fix this problem, though. Just move the subject closer to the verb. Isn't this better? Bald eagles turn their heads because their eyes leave no space in the skull for muscles that would allow them to roll their eyes. So, next time you're reading something and you have to reread it, check if the subject and verb are close together. That may be the problem, and it's an easy fix. If you're interested in learning more about developing good writing skills, the National Conservation Training Center has a series of courses that you might be interested in. And if you want to learn more about these, stay tuned after the episode, and I'll walk you through how to find these courses on the NCTC website. Thanks for joining us for the skill exercise today. If you have questions about this skill series, you can contact Linda Lufkin at the email and phone number below. If you have questions about this series or any other skills related to conservation, you can contact me at the information below. Thank you. Now, as promised, I was going to walk you through how to find these courses on the National Conservation Training Center website. If you go to any search engine and type in National Conservation Training Center, it's usually the first item that pops up. Click the link. And in the search bar, type communications catalog and hit search. And right at the very top, you see communications. Click that link. And then you can see all kinds of courses here. Here's our critical writing, critical thinking, digital communications, business communications. Down here we have writing with clarity. You can click any of these links to find more information about these courses. Thanks. Thanks again for joining us for Conservation Skills in 10 Minutes or Less. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like hit the subscribe button, share this video with a friend, or check out one of the many other skill-based videos in this series. Have a wonderful day, and always remember, the beautiful thing about learning is that no one can take it away from you.